Filipino Film Festival is back in St. Vincent and the Grenadines for our 2022 edition. We're so happy to finally be back and able to share films with people and gather here at the cruise ship terminal like we did tonight, where we showed two wonderful films and we had a great discussion post-screening Q&A with the director. And I think everybody has had a really, really amazing time. So this year, the festival runs from May 6th until the 21st. Mostly online, but May 6th and May 7th is here at the cruise ship terminal. May 7th is the Vincentian Filmmakers Night, which is open to the public. And so people are going to come and support their local Vincentian filmmakers. And then throughout the next two weeks, we have a few screenings that will be happening at Caribbeans here at the cruise ship terminal. And a couple more that will be happening at Flow Wine Bar. So we have kind of opportunities to watch things online and to also watch things here in person. We've also got a few really amazing workshops and panels, some really accomplished, incredible filmmakers and creatives. So all of that are really important resources for anybody working in independent Caribbean cinema. We're back. We're outside this year. HFF 2022 is coming home. We are home right now. And tonight we just had a little opening night event. Hey, and they're about to start the Q&A. So yeah, we showed Sprinter and now Aiko is going to be chatting it up with Storm Salta. So I hope you guys enjoy. Yeah. My, uh, my father's mother was born in St. Vincent. Last year, the film festival was virtual. So Aiko and I were in London and the rest of the team were in their homes in Barbados and in St. Vincent. And we were streaming on Caribbean time um, in an office in London until like three or 4 a.m. in the morning. It was crazy. So this year, it's so much nicer to be here in person and see everyone enjoying the films. Uh, it really is really meaningful. What a night, it was incredible. It was really inspirational seeing all the filmmakers in the room while their screenings were being shown. And then I was sat right at the back reading all of the live stream comments and people were, they were really relating to the films and they weren't just from St. Vincent, they were from all over the world, from Poland, from Barbados, a little bit closer, from the US. And I think that was really nice to see um, people engaging with Vincentian culture um, and just relating to it as well. It just shows that there's an audience obviously here, which is really important, but all over the world. And yeah, everyone should just keep going. And I feel very honored to be here. I work along with Caribbeans. I'm one of their mini staff. And it was really eye opener for the Caribbean staff to be associated with the film festival for this year, the Hiring of Film Festival. And it was really good. We enjoyed it. I actually took part in watching the films like i really like them and we look forward to doing it again continually working with the film festival and from the caribbean staff we want to say thank you guys for coming and being here with us and enjoying it and actually it was even a blessing for us all right <laughs>